this popular Nigerian food is enjoyed by everybody I mean almost everybody if you don't like it <laughs> I don't know again what you're going to like who but in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you how to make this popular Nigerian food from the very start to the very end so don't forget to get comfy and keep on watching and do give me a thumbs up if you end up liking this video so let's get into the streets and get cooking all right It's 9 a.m. in the morning and Mama Ada, she's popularly called, comes back from the market with loads and loads of plantain, ripe and unripe plantain. So this is what Mama Ada has been doing for the past 15 years. She's a single mom of five and she has been doing this business over time and it's what she has used to take care of her children and um, send them through school. So in today's video, she's going to be teaching us how to make this bowler because guys we are going to be learning from the best of the best yes so um bowler is simply one of the popular traditional foods here in nigeria it is also said to have originated in port harcourt the capital of river state nigeria this city is known for a lot of great things but the outstanding feature of its popular street food called Bole. So bole simply means just a roasted plantain and smoked fish. So the plantain could be either ripe or unripe. So it is usually served with peppered sauce made of pepper, salt, onions, oil, and you know all those seasonings. So bole is mostly enjoyed with roasted fish or chicken and leafy vegetables called tazi. Do you enjoy bole because personally I do and what mama Ada does is she cooks beans so other people love to eat um, their bole with beans so aside the plantains um, sweet potatoes as well as yams are being roasted as well that's if you do not enjoy uh, plantains which is like the roasted um, plantains so you can have that um, so she act she's actually now just making the fireplace using charcoal which is just just like a traditional way of doing this stuff some people use um, electricity to you know just make their bowling now because of technology but trust me we are doing this the traditional way today okay so if you are watching this please don't forget to give us a huge thumbs up please because it helps me out a lot on my youtube channel thank you guys so bole can be actually found in other parts of the country but Portacot Bole, <laughs> hey, Portacot Bole continues to take the lead in the Bole making, if you know what I mean. So guys, right now, Mama Ada's daughter is preparing, you know, onions and all of those good stuff for the sauce. So she actually helps her mom because she, right now she's out of school. And I asked her and she said this is a business she would really love to take over from her mom. Or maybe even own a shop of her own where she even does her bole. So I mentioned, I forgot to mention that bole in the western part of Nigeria is served with fried granuts. I personally haven't tried that. But I feel like whenever I visit Lagos, <laughs> I'm going to try this bole with granules. If you have ever tried bole with granules, please leave your comment in the comment section down below. Like, how was the experience? Do you like it? Do you prefer it to the regular sauce we usually have this side? Please leave your comment in the comment section down below. But if you have not had bole, <laughs> I mean, bole is one of Nigerian popular street foods. You should definitely give it a try if you ever come to the country it's for a long long time mm -hmm. now it's like 10 years wow Yeah, I 
so that you guys can come patronize her so she's just located at um, eagle cement here very close to the eagle cement at iwafe room so it's just pretty much close to access bank as you can see at, um, behind the people are using the atm machine that is the access bank atm machine so she's really in a very strategic place um such that people are passing and going to eagle cement right there so she gets to sell to a lot of people like people come here to buy um, so if you even need her to send it directly to you if you can't come here then there's a way we can actually do that but that is it so please if you should support her business please 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 she's a single mom and she has been doing this and taking care of my kids it's not easy and my kid is even following her to do it so I love to see when people are really hard working like this guys and the sauce is everything it's so mwah. it is so sweet I trust me it is so nice so back to the bullet so right now she's like turning the bullet so that it doesn't get burnt you know so she checks the fish the daughter is making is trying to put um, the ingredients together so they can make the sauce so yeah that's it they sell here show you the pay money show you the pay money for this stuff like how much a year? Is that expensive? It's not expensive because you can buy inside. So is there any months that you've not been able to pay? No, I pay every month. Okay. See, so somebody won't help you for the business. People where they watch. I think we'll see me then help you with for the business as they do so. We go help improve your business. Where we? Avi. Avi. Like now, they buy yam small small. Okay. If I get money now, if you go yam soon, buy like two hundred pieces. Okay. Huh. Okay. 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 Okay, so buying small, 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 small. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. So guys, a lot of people who prefer to sit down here and eat this is where 
they sit down to have their food. I'm not sure what they usually sell in restaurants. So if you have seen the restaurants selling, selling like bullet, please let me know in the comment section, okay? How much are you selling each of them? From 100 naira. Mm, okay. The size be. Mm. Okay, okay. Pop to my feet buyer. So guys, it's already 12 p.m. and that is when the workers from the neighboring companies come out to pretty much eat from here some that want to eat bully of course um so right now um her daughter is trying to serve um this uh, bullet to somebody let's see how she does it okay <laughs> Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. I know that if you're a bole lover, I know you're going to leave a comment for me in the comment section down below, or at least you're going to give me a huge thumbs up. Cause guys, I've stayed, stayed here for three hours, so just to give you guys this content. So liking the video helps. It helps me a lot too so please like the video if you really enjoy it even if you don't enjoy it just give me a thumbs up mm? <laughs> support our ministry all right okay let's go so guys you may be wondering how do you get to eat this bole if you cannot come to this other part of the town so bole is prepared locally on the streets of put her coats from start to finish on the street okay so but it isn't hard to locate it is just found virtually everywhere on the street okay with their colorful umbrellas probably shielding them from the sun and the ever on ending rain of Port Harcourt. So you're going to pretty much see Bole on every corner of the streets. I promise you. Okay. All right. So don't forget to give your girl a huge thumbs up and tell me what you want to see next in our upcoming videos because I'm here to serve you guys. Okay. And don't forget to watch the ads. Oh, don't skip the ads. Okay. <laughs> Guys, I really wanted you guys to feel like the street vibes, the noise, everything coming up from this place. But I can't because of copyrighted music. All right, so just yeah, just bear with me, okay? <laughs> we are inside. <laughs> yes. Like this one, I want to do anything for you. Okay. Okay. Okay.
I was wondering whether that one not finished very soon. These ones you already put. I was thinking this is all. Yeah. Okay. So guys, here are we trying to eat our own bole. When are you going to buy your bole? Please try and invite me, okay? Alright, I'll see you guys in another video. And by the way, it was yummy. <laughs>